What's going on everyone, Polartron here, back here with another Darman video reaction and today I'm going to be checking out Kid Ruin Mom's Job Interview. Now, I don't know what this is all about, but this kid, Mikey, we already know he's a troublemaker. He can do anything to get his mom fired and, you know, I think he's going to get her fired because... She's going to move away to a different, they want to move away to a different city or something and he doesn't want to go. So he's just going to, you know, yeah, I don't know. He's just going to say bad rumors about his mom to the employer or something and probably scream and, you know, ruin the interview so he can stay with his friends or whatever. But man, let me know what your thoughts are. Make sure to go like the video, comment down below, subscribe to the channel. I'm really excited to check this out, and let's go. Here you go, man. You know I got you. Thanks. What's this? What's wrong? I thought you love ice cream bars. I do, I just... Oh, ice cream! I'm out of my mind. Oh, really? Usually your mind is, like, empty. Ha ha. Very funny. <laughs> <You're> funny? <laughs> Calling him dumb. <laughs> just, my mom has an interview on Saturday. Oh, sweet! That could be a good thing. My dad had an interview last week, and he could be getting paid twice as much if he gets the job. Which means you get maybe more stuff. Maybe your mom can make more money too and get you that new laptop you wanted. Yeah, maybe. The only problem is, I'd have to go to a different school. Oh. Exactly. Yeah, they're best friends. They're best my buds. They're both troublemakers. She said that if she got this job, I'd have to move to a different area. Probably have to go to. John Adams Middle School. Bro. That's so John sucks. Adams. Oh because no, the infamous school. school. I heard they don't even watch Dar, man. They watch the copycats. <laughs> that great. That just makes things <laughs> Holy shit! Did you? Bro. <laughs> that sucks. Buddy, did they really do this? I heard they don't even watch Dar, man. They watch the copycats. Oh! oh great. <laughs> that just makes things worse. Plus. I know you guys probably understand the joke, man. They can't bring us up. Let's see if you guys can. I mean, we've been best friends since first grade. Well, since second grade. I had a different best friend in first grade, but when he moved away, you became my best best friend. Yeah. Okay, they don't want to lose each other. But I don't want to lose another best friend. Does your mom not know we got a good thing going here? I guess not. You're ridiculous. Hmm. No. Why don't you just still go to that school? at this school. No one comes up with schemes like us. Exactly. Oh, remember when we pretended to break our arms and got away with it? Oh, yeah! <laughs> Man, I actually did break my arm, though. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. True, true, true. I don't remember the story. Oh, oh, wait, I think I do, maybe. But, bro, remember that time we skipped out of class and no one noticed? Blessing! And you ate pizza? <laughs> wait. We didn't get away with that either. <laughs> Yeah, I guess yeah but the funny thing everything. is, you guys were together that yeah. time. <sighs> but at least we have fun doing it. Yeah, you know. Oh, the best <laughs> buds. Get the job. This school wouldn't be the same without you. Yeah. No Wait, shit, it wouldn't. My mom thinks she has it down. She has a lucky necklace and everything. She thinks she can ace the interview. She bad we can't make the interview go bad. That way, for sure, you wouldn't have to move schools. That's it. Oh, That's no. it. We gotta sabotage your interview. Ooh, I was joking, man. We cannot do that. Uh, of course we can. We're Jay and Mikey, the dynamic duo. The dynamic duo. You we already know. Can do anything. But if we got caught, we won't get caught. Besides, we have no choice. The most important thing is on the line. Our friendship. All right. Let's do it. Yeah, I guess. I guess no Jay can't refuse. We'll have to get That's my boy. Okay. We gotta cook up a plan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was thinking you come over to my house on Friday so we can have a sleepover. Oh my gosh, you see what you're doing? And then oh. we can replace my mom's real resume with a fake. Bro, but she might have a copy somewhere, so it's not gonna work. Confirm, we gotta roll that. Okay. The PS5 <gasps> controller just lying there. I want my mom to hear you, remember? All right, here's the plan. You see this laxative? Yeah. Then pour it into that water thing in the gym. Coffee machine. All right, and 
There's only a little bit in there, so use it all. But then she's gonna find this out. Will definitely ruin her interview. <laughs> you know that. The laxatives <laughs> are gonna make her poop. This cup is a little tricky. I think it's childproof. Let a man do it. Bro, the, it literally shows you how to do it on the, on the cap. It's See? not that hard. It's stuck. I think you squeeze it, right, press it down, and then Look, open it. I gotta sneak into my mom's room and steal her lucky necklace. And plus, I have to replace her real resume with a fake. And then we gotta rendezvous back to my room. Got it? Wait! What does rendezvous mean? Just come back to my room when you're done. Buddy, you don't know what that means? Oh, he opened it. Oh shit, 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 oh shit. And you dropped it. I have an idea. Soak it up with the tissue and then ring it out into the coffee machine. And you Gucci. And uh She's meditating. The brick. If you knock, knock the door, the door will be opened. Be opened. And again, Bro, she's trying so hard to get, like, hired. And, uh, imagine a beautiful white there it is. The resume. Oh, you better hide, buddy. Okay, buddy. Man, that was a dick move right there for you, Mikey. Hello? Yes, I'll be there right at nine. Uh, I wouldn't miss it for the world. Great. We'll see you soon. Yo! Oh, there it is. That is scary as hell. Like you would have you would have got caught that moment, man. Like no cap. That was close. Too close. <sighs> you really are lucky. Just pour it in the cup. Just pour it in her coffee cup. It's much easier that way. You scared me. I was trying to hide your coffee maker. What? Why? I dropped the laxative and it all fell out. So I, I thought of a backup plan. If she can't find the coffee machine, she won't be able to make her coffee so she can't leave. And that's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. What Give it to voice? me. <gasps> you two are up early. What mom, how are you? Why are you holding the coffee machine? Well, you see, that's all right. Let's go to my uh, we were, um, Bro, this is already getting sucked. What do you say? In the living room. Uh, you were, uh, gonna take it to my bedroom and make it a surprise. <laughs> well, that definitely would have been a surprise. But no, make it in the kitchen. Got you, thank you. Yeah, you're already. You boys are so sweet. <laughs> I'm gonna go finish getting ready. Her mom's kind of stupid because she knows what type of person Did Mikey is and she's not questioning him. Nope. Great. Look at the mess you got us into. By the way, Mikey, have you seen my necklace? I could have sworn I had it in my room. No, Mom, I haven't seen it. I really wanted to wear that today. I've always had it with me on important days. Well, looks like you can't leave without it. Is this so important to you? No. I mean, no, she's going to go without it. go without it. But, like, you know... He's not gonna want to go without it. What's with you, Mikey? Mom, I'm gonna put your coffee in the car. Did 
Too bad there's no accident in it. Sorry. This isn't really going exactly as we planned. Uh, Pop the tire. Think? Well, it's at genius. Least we saw a resume. Man, I wish think I could be there about when they it. it. If you I'm pop the tire, you're, you're Gucci. What did you do with the real one? Great question. Mikey, were you in my room? Uh, I found this under my bed. Uh, no. That's Mom, a real I, resume. I isn't it? Wow, that's weird. I feel like I'm losing my mind. I, Maybe you're just nervous for the interview. You could be right. I better make sure I have my wallet and my keys. She has a real one. Okay, all good. <gasps> okay, what's this for? Hug for good luck. Since you lost your necklace. Aw, you are so sweet. Thank you. You're welcome. Do you want me to do anything else for you? Like, are you your resume? You Bro, he's want to review my resume. He's like a ten-year-old, nine-year-old sure, you know, man. Yeah, Why would you get a nine-year-old to review to get a an adult, a grown-ass adult's resume? Um, that's okay. I better get going. I don't want to be late. All right. Okay, boys. Well, be good and don't get in too much trouble. We won't. Oh, how was I supposed to get the resume into the folder? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Oh, thank Carter. See, you think it's that easy? Hmm. That's it. Drop! Are you really gonna sneak? What are you... Mm. Mm. <sighs> how are you gonna pull yeah. this off? Is the last time I have him make necklace, me coffee. Necklace, necklace. I saw the necklace. Ugh. Ooh, the man got fresh jays. Oh my gosh! How did you get back here? <laughs> I don't remember leaving you there. But I'm so glad I found you. This is a Good sign. Mikey, you fucked up. You got this, girl. Hi, I'm Kathy Miller. I have an interview with Dr. Andrews. Miller. Oh, for 9 a.m.? That's me. Actually, can I steal you? Can you take Nurse Miller here? She needs to go so back. So she to wants to be place. like some type of doctor or something, a nurse or, I don't know. Dr. Andrews, your 9 a.m. is here. Trying to Miss be a Miller, doctor. Right? Yes. Yeah, she's gonna make fair first. money. Will you take her to the waiting area first, nurse? I just need one minute. Sure, okay. Hey, this is getting out of hand. Even for me. Come on, bro, we're so close. Don't give up. Give it a chance. Come on. Can I help you too? Yes. We're here to see our grandma. <laughs> I don't think any old people pajamas. work here. Uh... You are unstoppable, Kathy Miller. We came as soon as we heard the news. Mm -hmm. She's not doing so well. Oh, we don't know how much time we have left with her. Bro, what we the? We really gotta see her. ASAP. Okay, w what's her name? Uh, Oprah. Oprah Winfrey. Winfrey. I'm doing this for my sons. Oprah, Wait, what, what type of she name is this? She doesn't even have there? any ch... This is clear. Let me see the resume. Here. Mm -hmm. Hurry up and let's get out of here. Matter of fact, I'll meet you outside. Bro, Bro what where type are of friend you? are you? This scary cat guy do everything by myself. It's really good of you to come. Oh, so, oh yeah. shit. Thank you again for coming in this morning. You know, it's my pleasure. <gasps> West Hills Medical is my dream job. Please. 
You guys do amazing work here. Which is why we only interview the best candidates. Thank you. Let's take a look here. I'm sure you'll find I have all the necessary experience. So you got your degree from Poopy Pants University. Poopy, what? And for 20 years, you were a nurse in space? Your references are Chewbacca and Superman. <laughs> uh, are, are you pulling my leg? This, there must be some mistake. For address, you wrote your mama's house. <laughs> Shit. I thought you'd be taking this seriously. I am, I do. That is not my resume. But it has your name on it. Kathy Fart Bucket Miller the <laughs> Third. I have no idea how that got in there. <laughs> great things about you from your hospital director. But it seems like you've just come here to waste my time. No, no, I swear I would never do that. What I'm is so this? confused right now. Oh, is someone there? What in the world? I'm mom. Um... This is all making sense now. Do you know this kid? I do. Jesus. That's my son. I am terribly sorry about this. Just go. I won't waste your time anymore. Right, please just go. Please Thank just you go. For the opportunity. Oh. Wow, lost a job because of him. Go to your room while I think of a punishment. Mom. No, I don't want to hear it. You know, Jay's mom is really upset too. Why would you do something like that? Give me one reason why you thought that was a good okay, idea. Okay, let's hear it. Because, because I don't want to lose Jay. What do you mean? If you got the new job, I have to move to a new school and never get to see Jay again. That's why I never. knows he will never have a best friend again and yeah because nobody hand, likes you because you're you always do bad heart. stuff oh honey is that what you were worried about if i lost jay i'd be sad and that's not what it's true no, no, that doesn't sound dumb i guess i just never knew how you felt but let me tell you something. Jay is not your best friend because you go to the same school. He's your best friend because of all of the memories you have together and all the fun you share. Yeah, but it's not going to be the same. And that doesn't have to change. You really think so? Yes. Did you know that one of my best friends lives in another state? Now we're still very close. As a matter of fact, she sent me this card with this great quote on it. Really? Here it is. Yeah, but it's your still not friend can It's be not fun to be far, far away from your friends. Because you don't love them for where they're at. You love them for who they are. I really like that. I guess I never thought of it that way. I'm really sorry for ruining your interview, Mom. Well, I completely understand why you did it, but you are not off the hook that easy. You, you still cost deserve me my new punishment. job. I'm gonna go get changed, and then we're gonna talk about your consequences. I mean, you could have told her before. What's up? You guys, you got grounded? Yeah, I got grounded. But, um, that's not the only thing. What? My dad just told me some news. He also what moved news? to the same area. Remember I told you he had a job interview last week? Mm-hmm. He got the job. I, I didn't realize it was out of town, so... We're gonna have to move next week. What? I'll be going to John Adams Middle School. Oh! Oh. So it's a new school. He doesn't want to be there. Hey! Anybody want to dorm around here? Mikey? Miss me, brother? Yo, Whoa! The doctor called up my mom for a second interview? Or, come, come, a real first one. But she got the job! Yes! The dynamic duo is back! Dude! Jay and Mikey! Better than ever! I'm so glad you're here. This school is lame. Yeah? 
Well, then let's shake things up a bit, eh? Sir. None of the teachers know my skin. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna change the whole yeah, school. Gonna they're gonna turn this face into this. Like, seriously, I'm man. I'm gonna retire. Yo, you already boys. know. You know it. Well, I might have already used the people. Yo, you we never learned to be. Not at all, bro. Not at all. Mom, can I get this backpack? But yo, that is it for the Darman video. Kids ruin mom's job interview. What happens next will shock you. I mean, yo, this is truly a shocking story. It's just so cool how they both went to the same school. They ended up moving to a different school and it happened to be the same one. The dynamic duo has not been separated. But let me know what your thoughts are. Don't forget to like the video, comment down below, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.